if you inspect your stamp, you might see a problem with your architects, and that has something to do with inserting and scaling it up. So what we can do is we can uh, fix this by uh, importing it as a block. So we're going to open our title block uh, where the original stamp was. Uh, I think it's called, my file is called title block 11 by 17. There you go. As you can see, this one is uh, all correct, um, except that um, this one has an overlapping, so we can adjust this again using our text. And I can simply adjust the character spacing here uh, or the width factor. Uh, so let's do a combination of both. I'm going to do a 0.4 here, enter, and repeat our text. And I'm going to adjust this to 0.85, enter, and see whether that's enough. Uh, it's a little bit more. So we're going to click on this one and our text again. And maybe 0.80 is enough. There you go. So 0.80 and 0.85. So we're going to just save that. And what I want to do is I want to preserve um, all of this. So let me just copy this whole thing. So I'm going to do a copy and copy this whole thing and put it right on this side. Okay. And um, I want to copy the signature. So I'm going to delete the signature. Let me do the image frame. Okay, so I can select the signature, image frame, and then let me put it to one so I can erase that signature. Okay, and then I wanted to make a block of this one, but I wanted to make a file at the same time so I can insert this one. So I don't want to select and then control C and then go back here and then control V. I'm going to end up with some problem again. Okay, so if I do that and then scale this down, to a, center point, where's the center? Center is over here. If I scale that again, you can see it's, it, there's going to be some problems again. So we, I don't want to do that. Okay, so I don't want to copy and paste. So what I want to do is I want to go back here and I wanted to make a block out of this one um, by doing a W block. So W block stands for right block. So right block means that whatever I select will be a file. Okay, so first I wanted to select a pick point for the base point, so pick point. And I wanted somewhere here with the center. So I, let me see if I can find a center of, of all of this. It doesn't look like. So let me see if I can do a circle first and find the center of this circle. Maybe my O snap is not on. So there it is, right? So there's the center is here. The line to the center or insertion. There insertion. No. Line I and S. And the insertion point of this point is not here. Hmm. This, the line is here, but I can't select that. <clears throat> okay. It's not important right now. So let me just do W block. And then I wanted to pick point. I want to pick somewhere here at the center. And then I wanted to select the objects and I want to select everything here. Okay enter and then it will say here file name because you want to put it as a file name. so you're going to click this three dots here and then you're going to go to your my drive and then go to whatever engineering file or name you have and then you wanted to put here your new stamp okay new stamp there you go And then click save and then everything's okay so click close and then we don't need this anymore but we can leave it there then we're going to go back here and then we're going to type in insert insert and then this box might appear here okay and you want to click on this uh, icon here okay so click on that icon and then this select file insert will appear and then all you have to do is find your new stamp here 
you stamp over here, click, and then click open. And then it will become a big file, right? Big file. So uh, let's erase this first one because this was a. So select that, click new stamp, click open, point here, and then um, you can scale this now. But because this one was inserted as a file, it is a block. It will preserve the spacing. Okay, so we're going to do a scale. Select this. Press Enter. Click anywhere, and then we're going to use reference. We're going to use 432 because that was the size of our drawing before. 432, and we want to change it to 17. 17. Enter, and then if you zoom in, everything is preserved. So all you're going to do is we're going to move this and we're going to swap that with this drawing here okay so we're going to erase all of this except for the uh, signature so we're going to do a uh, image frame again and let's see uh, whether we have the image frame back image frame, image frame. There go zero image frame back to one there you go um, and then we're going to move this box and put that somewhere here okay maybe i want to move that there you go and then i want to erase everything on this side and move everything here put it back center it the best you can and then adjust again your image frame back to zero there you go and that's how to fix that okay